Hey guys, back with part four. And we're on Los Ojos de la Mora, which I don't know what Mora means, but I can get the rest of it. You good with your speed? After a nine that was pushing my current physical condition, we got another one that's going to be about the same speed, so we'll see what happens. Another song that plays like a revenge chart. Uh, I like the crossovers in the middle, though I did think the run went on. Well, sorry for the music. Tiring for me. Uh, that one thing I think I would say I didn't like was the was the freezes moving my foot around. Not that they were hard, but <coughs> it's not my favorite thing at that speed. But and overall, it was a pretty pretty good nine and pretty. Pretty fun. I'd also probably not have the double step in close proximity to a step jump, but some nitpicks. Um, I thought it was pretty good. There were some gallops where I felt like I was having to double step, but that could just be me choosing the wrong foot position, as I tend to do. So. And towards the end, I could read it, but after biking home from work, my legs won't move where they tell them to. Where there are crossovers at, on eighth notes at 190 BPM on, on standard? Yeah. Would you think that's a seven or an eight? I don't know. It was that's fun. I just physically could not do it right now. If I did that later when I'm all rested, I could do that. Just, that sounds like an eight pattern to me, but I wasn't playing the chart, so I can't really judge. It was fun, though. All right. Swedish, or I shouldn't say that. My guess would be Norwegian, actually. Dance cover. Someone will correct me because I'm sure that I'm going to get it wrong, but. What was it? Uh, 155. My guess is that that language is Norwegian or like maybe Danish. Well, if you guess all the, Nor the uh, Norris, I guess, countries. You'll get it eventually. I don't think it's Swedish or Finnish. I don't see a lot of 
easy nines in competitions. There's some, but I see a lot of top end nines. by the book, but I mean, it, it, it's, it's abyss, it's freckles, and everyone, it's, it's a standard seven, it, well, it's a heavy seven, but it's a normal seven, it's nothing too exceptional about it, but it's fun, and people would warm up on this, and triple A early in their DDR period, relatively. Um, mine had a few single gallops that felt like they were just there to add difficulty and didn't really go with the music, but it was fun, so I can't say too much bad about it. I'm not one to knock a formula that works. But there's definitely pro there's probably a little room for innovation in that chart, but I, I really enjoyed it. I hope that's not just the I'm tired of nines coming out, though. straight flow. And my, like I said, my only other complaint there was that part where you were basically, where you were expecting me to melt the freeze. Uh, it's not something I'm a fan of. But that was a very fun chart. It's probably straddling between a 7 and an 8, but because of the crossovers I think it is, but I like the crossovers. Very tasteful. Uh, good runs, good flow. I suck. <laughs> Okay. All right. See you next time.